Hey guys, welcome back to QB240. Today I'm going to be showing you how to download CS Timer on your phone and on your PC. So let's get right into it. Starting off on the phone, you want to go to Safari first and then go to CSTimer.net. Then this little button that's circled up here, you want to click that. Now scroll down and scroll across until you find this, add to home screen and click on it and click add. Right. Now that would add it to your home screen and now you can enter it. When you first go into it, it looks really plain like this, but I'm just going to quickly put in my preferred settings. Okay, there we go. I've signed into my Google account and I'm importing my preferred settings. There we go. So it works. You just touch the screen and it'll start the timer. This. So you have inspection and then you can solve it. There we go. That's all there is to it. Okay, now moving on to PC, you want to go open up a browser and go to CS Timer. Now up there, the uh, button that circled, old, you want to click that, and you have to click Open or Installed. I've already got it installed, so I just have to click Open. Now, so if I close it and go to a different browser, this browser is now brave, it's still Chrome. Go to CSTimer.net Now see there's a little plus here now, install CS Timer. Then you click install. That's what you have to do if it's not already installed. It only takes a second to install and there we go. Now you can input your settings which I suggest you doing this if you have it on your phone and your laptop because then you can have the um your um cells go between both your phone and your laptop or your PC or whatever you use. Okay, there we go. It's installed. Okay, so now if we don't need, we can pin it to the taskbar, so then it stays there. Then when we close it, it's always there, and we can just open it straight back into CS Timer. Just like that. So you can use the spacebar to start it, and just do yourself. Thanks for watching.